Hey guys, how you keeping? And welcome to GK. Be sure to subscribe if you're a number one. The following advice I'm going to share may sound simple. However, the ready position is the foundation for everything we do as goalkeepers, and it is therefore essential that we get it correct. You should start by having your feet shoulder width apart. This should feel both comfortable and natural. From there, bend your knees a little and push your weight ever so slightly forward so that you rock onto your toes. This position should feel effortless. It should allow you to gently bounce on your toes from side to side. You should also feel light on your feet and ready to spring into action. The bouncing motion is similar to that of a boxer. The slight bend in our knees combined with the fact that you're on your toes gives you the mechanical starting point to generate thrust and momentum. Think of it as a 100 meter sprinter about to start the race. It's not from a standing start, but instead is coiled up and ready to explode into action. Whilst we're not coiled up to this extent, it does illustrate the point well. Be sure to find the correct balance. If your knees are too bent, it takes too long for you to meaningfully react. And if they are too straight, you have no flexibility to push in one direction. Our hands must also be ready to be called into action. For this, we must have active hands. Active hands are in a comfortable position, typically between your waist and chest height. And your shoulders and elbows should have enough tension to maintain this position. However, they are largely relaxed and loose. It is also important to have your hands in front of you slightly. You should be able to see your hands in your peripheral view. This is important psychologically as your mind is more aware of your hands and you will naturally call them into action. It is also important as the majority of techniques are performed in front of you. A catch is the perfect example, but it also helps with the less obvious techniques such as diving as this should also be performed with forward momentum as opposed to being entirely lateral. By perfecting the ready position, it will enable you to react to any situation. You will be able to come out quickly, you will be able to readjust, and most importantly, you will be ready to make match winning saves. Be sure to check out my other futsal videos, and I wish all the keepers out there the safest of hands.